One thing that's always fascinated me is the value of sports memorabilia. Well, we've got three items for you today which are really sensational. Ken Golden is here with Golden Auctions, and he's the man in charge of auctioning these off. Ken, welcome back to the program. Glad to be with you, Stuart. I'm going to hold this up, and I'm going to handle it very delicately. This, ladies and gentlemen, is the marriage certificate of Joe DiMaggio and Marilyn Monroe way back in 1954, I think it is. Exactly. 1954 in San Francisco, of course, uh, Norma Jean Doherty at the time, uh, marrying, uh, marrying Joseph uh, Paul DiMaggio yep. in 1954. That is the original marriage certificate. And and uh, Joe DiMaggio died owning that certificate. It was part of his estate. He loved her. Yes, he did. Sent roses to her grave for over 20 years after her death. And again, what's the estimated price that you'll get for this? Uh, we're figuring 75,000 plus on the certificate. $75,000 plus. Correct. Well, worth what? I mean, DiMaggio was a sensational player. Mm -hmm. Marilyn Monroe was a sensational person in her own right. Yes. The marriage certificate, 75 k I can go for that. Yep. Next, what is this? You've got a jersey in front of me. Yes, this is extremely special. <clears throat> this is Yogi Berra's actual game used uh, jersey from the 1961 World Series, which is uh, viewed as one of the two greatest baseball teams of all time. And what's important about this is it's photo matched to game two, which is when he hit, he hit his final World Series career home run. Really? Yes. So he was wearing that when he hit the final home run in the World Series? Correct. Of his career? That is correct. Okay, Stuart Barney question, how much? Uh, the price? About $125,000. $125,000. Worth every penny, I might Absolutely. Um, okay, now I've never actually seen a Heisman Trophy before, and I'm not going to ask you to hold it up yeah, because that is extraordinarily heavy. You saw me struggle to put it on the table, yes. <laughs> Whose Heisman is it? This is uh, Paul Horning when he uh, won the Heisman Award for uh, Notre Dame and, of course, became an NFL Hall of Famer for the Green Bay Packers. Now, why is it that I've never seen or touched or had a Heisman on my show before? Uh, first of all, they're very rare. Yeah. They are the single most sought after award in all of sports. More than a World Series ring, more than a Super Bowl trophy. You know, to collectors, Heisman is the ultimate. And uh, they very rarely have gone for sale. And recently, the uh, Downtown Athletic Club, the Heisman Award, they've actually stopped you know, make the athlete sign a contract kind of like the Oscars do, whereby if you win this award, you're not allowed to sell it. Paul Horning was an exception, uh, and uh, he sold his trophy. How much estimated price? Uh, estimated price for this is 250000 and up, and it does come with a letter of authenticity from Paul Horning himself. I should hope so, too. Yes, sir. Um, the auction ends tomorrow, I think? Yes, Saturday, May 20th. Uh, it is a live auction. It's currently available. You can go to goldenauctions.com and place a bid, and it's actually a live event, uh, 7 p.m. at New York Yankee Steakhouse, uh, Midtown Manhattan. I have to squeeze this in. I want to have time for this. Sure. Uh, do people buy buy these to put them into some kind of museum collection? Is it museum people who buy these things, or is it wealthy individuals? It's wealthy individuals who have their own museums. Uh, I mean, these people build, and build man caves and they display the items. Ken Golden, thank you very much for bringing us some truly out, uh, terrific stuff again today. Thank you for having it. me. Always a pleasure. Ken Golden, everyone, thank you.